Hi YouTube, Tim Unkert from UnkertEducation.com here. In today's video, we're going to install the Eclipse IDE on a Windows machine. So I'm going to open up a browser here, and I'm going to search for Eclipse IDE and hit enter. I'll go here, and if I go here, I want to go to download, so I'm going to click on that. And we have the Eclipse installer, so I'm going to download this. And I'll click download again. You can give a donation if you want to the Eclipse community to help support this project. I'm not going to do that today. Okay. Once it downloads, you get a pop up here, or you can find this in your downloads folder. I'm going to click on this to open the file. And you have a bunch of choices here. Uh, you can do in Eclipse ID for Java. You can do Java and web, you can do C, C++, you can do embedded C, you can do PHP, uh, so on and so forth. I'm going to do it for PHP. Okay, so I'll click on that and I'm going to click install. And you have to accept the user agreement, so I'm going to accept that, accept that and it's going to go ahead and install. Okay, you may get this pop-up. Do you trust unsigned content of unknown origin? I'm going to click on that and say trust selected. And now it's been installed. We can click the launch button and we can select a workspace. I'm going to click launch. And here you go. Uh, Eclipse launches and opens and we got this welcome screen here. Um, they also have this thing that pops up to donate. I'm going to close that out. Um, yeah, and you can go through and you can begin to set up your development environment and set up your PHP project. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please like and subscribe. Thank you.